to my video today and I really appreciate it. I hope you're all having a really good Sunday. I know I am. I really appreciate if you could all like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, all the usual, and also subscribe to my socials, which I'll link here, here, and here. <laughs> I feel like an air hostess doing that. Today I'm going to be doing a haul of some autumn winter clothes. I was really undecided of what shop that I wanted to like go for. I was toying between like Topshop, Pretty Little Thing, Misguided, but in the end I went for Zara. I think they definitely by far have all the best stuff at the minute. Every time I go in there I could spend like hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of pounds so I thought that was the best shop to go for but if there's any other hauls that you'd like to see me do I do have a couple of ideas but I'm always open to suggestions. So the first item in the haul is a little black play suit it is this one here it is a blazer play suit it was 59.99 and I got it in a medium in terms of how it is, it's got like these quite puffy sleeves which are really in at the minute. You get this big, thick, chunky belt which is really nice because you could use it for other things. And then it's got buttons here to open it up. And then there's the shorts. I don't know if you can see these. So the shorts are here and then you button it up. And it becomes the play suit. In terms of quality, it's really, really thick. It's such good quality. I definitely think it is worth the 59 99 so £60. The only thing is I personally have a bit of a disproportionate body, so I've not got any boobs, but I've got a huge bottom. So the bottom fits really, really well, like probably one of the best play suits I've ever had that doesn't let any cheek overhang. Um, but it's a bit big around my boobs, but as you'll see on the, the try-on clip, it's not obviously big, so it's fine and I could get away with it. I just think if you're like in between sizes or if you're, you've got a small bum but big boobs, then definitely like get the smaller size because it will 100% fit your boobs. Because like I said, it was really big on mine. Here and I think it'd be perfect for just like a date night or day drinking because you're not allowed out after 10 so I think it'd be perfect for any of them. Second thing I got was these like calmly nude leather leggings. I'm obsessed with le leather leggings when it comes to autumn winter even in summer I still wear them. I think these are such a nice colour. I love all the neutrals. The only thing is I bought them in a mid-rise now, I don't know if they do them in high-rise. I know they definitely do the black leggings in a high-rise. But I bought them in mid-rise and that was just a massive mistake. I also got them in a medium and I do think they come up like quite small. Like I said before, I do have a big bum so I usually do size up anyway. But I've bought other things from Zara in a medium and they, it's fit me fine. But these were just a bit of a squeeze to get on and I know they're the leather leggings but I definitely would get a bigger size. They were $19.99 so fairly cheap I think all my other leather leggings are from Topshop and they were all like like 35 quid or something so they're pretty much the same quality. They're lined on the inside with like this nice like fluffy material so it doesn't stick to you. It also has a little stripe down the middle of it and it's got little zips at the bottom so you can zip that up and down. I obviously probably just zip them down. In terms of the mid-rise fitting, I, unless you are straight up and down and have the flattest tummy ever and love mid-rise, I would definitely go for high-rise and I'd definitely size up in them because, like I said, they do come up fairly small. Second, I thought that would like go really cute with it and match those leggings is this snake print shoulder padded top I don't know if it's classed as like a tunic or something but it's really really cute it's so nice on and um, the shoulder pads are just really in at the minute as I've bought everything that's pretty much got shoulder pads in it it was 
19.99 so so cheap um i've got that in a medium as well and then it's got these little three gold buttons at the back in terms of fitting i think it's pretty much true to size i think it looks really nice on i think it would be perfect for on um, winter time with either like those brown leather leggings or even just some mum jeans so i'd wear that out shopping with the girls or even to like a nice meal like jeans and a nice top this is a perfect nice top so yeah for the price and the quality of it once again smashing it Sarah next what I got was this so it comes up pretty high rise it is very padded out as you'll see on the try on clip it was I think I got this in the medium as well I've got most things in the medium I think yeah and this was also 19.99 which is such good value for money considering it's like a knitwear piece i think it looks nice with those brown leather leggings and i think it's just a perfect like autumn time because even like now we're in september and it's fairly sunny but i would still wear knitwear because i think it's cold so to just put this on and then obviously it's you've got your arms out but with like a nice like teddy coat those leggings and either like some chunky trainers or some nice boots i just think it would be perfect going through this fairly fast i would say oh i nearly forgot actually to match that outfit that i just got i bought a little berry now i can't try it on now because obviously my hair is up it's not a ponytail but i did try it on yesterday so i'll show the picture excuse the no makeup but i didn't want to wear makeup when i was trying on the clothes because i didn't want to get all over everything so there's nothing more annoying got that in a small to medium i think i've got a fairly normal size head and that fit me perfectly i just think they're so cute i love a hat and i think if you're going to the christmas markets which obviously we probably won't this year but even just like a garden center and you want to look like nice and all christmasy these hats are just perfect for that and um, so that was 15.99 thing in the haul i decided to go for some loungewear pieces Zara at the minute are like proper killing it with their loungewear. They're doing lots of cute little like two pieces, three pieces, cord outfits and I for one am loving them. They're so good for just lounging around the house. So I got these khaki trousers, well maybe like an olive kind of khaki colour. They're ripped material, they do come up fairly long, I'm five foot six and as you can see they are quite long and they fit me perfectly but I think if you're any small they might be a bit too long so that's something to bear in mind. So I've got them in a medium as well and these were $17.99 but in terms of quality they're not very thick but then I don't think that they need to be. If we were allowed to go on holiday they'd be perfect for wearing to the airport because they're really really comfy especially if you're doing like long haul. I got this little waistcoat to match now i know like waistcoats are really in at the minute so you don't necessarily have to wear these together like you could wear those trousers with like a bodysuit and these with maybe like a jumper underneath and some jeans but again it's the same like ribbed material this does come up like fairly long and v-necked that may seem a bit silly but i was saying before that you can get like two pieces and three pieces this did have like a little top to match which I think would look nice because it came to about here which you'll see on the try on clip and um, the little buttons are they're just green to match if you can see it's got nice big pockets so you can shovel your stuff in it when you're walking around the house all your chocolates and sweets which is what I put in it anyway I got that in a, a medium as well that was 19.99 depending how you want to wear it I would say you could probably size down in it. Next up, I got a pair of jeans. I've never bought a pair of jeans from Zara before. I actually used to work for Topshop. So most of my clothes used to be from Topshop and all my jeans were from Topshop. So I've never actually bought any jeans from anywhere else. I decided to venture out and I got these. They're like the straight leg. They've got the rips in the knees. One thing I would say is, as you can tell, they do come up really, really long. Like I said, I'm 5'6", 
and I would definitely need like my Air Force's like chunky chain or something for them not to drag on the floor. I personally think they come up quite small. I don't know if anyone else has felt that way about Zara jeans, but I got these in a 12, which I would say I probably am, but they just felt still quite tight round my bum and round my thighs which I don't think I'm a 14. I would say they come up fairly small, but I think a lot of jeans can be like that because they are really like thick material. Um, but they're such good quality, 29.99 is an absolute bargain if you compare that to like top shop prices. Yeah, they are nice. They're an okay fit. I would definitely buy some again. These were the high rise ones, high rise wide leg. I'll link everything that I've got down below anyway. Next up, I've got this really cute little black crop top. It has got a high neck turtleneck sleeve, some of the rouge detailing at the side that Zara are doing a lot of at the minute. It's really nice, it fits really really well. It, I got in a medium again, it was $12.99. In terms of the material, it was a bit not what I was expecting in the fact that it's like a legging material, like a gym kind of leg in one but I think it's just a lot better quality it's also double lined so if you didn't want to wear a bra you wouldn't need to I really liked that and definitely be keeping it I think for the like value for money it's spot on another really good like autumn winter piece which I didn't actually buy with all of this I got it probably about two or three weeks ago from Zara thought it would be worth mentioning is this black leather blazer it's just so gorgeous. It was really reasonably priced, like $59.99 I think it was. I got it in a small. It's definitely quite like, it's fairly big. So you could size down it depending how you like it to fit. I wanted mine to be oversized, but I've worn it with over like jeans, over a dress. I've even just worn it with some cycling shorts. So versatile, it's really really nice. The time I go in afterwards, it sold out. They only had one when I was there, and luckily it was in my size. But yeah, it's really really nice. So next up is another turtleneck because what is autumn winter without turtlenecks? This one's such a lovely colour, perfect for the season in this chocolate brown. It was $7.99, so reasonably priced. Bit of a different material to the last one in the fact it's more of like a a jersey kind of style rather than a like thick leggy one. Also say in terms of sizing, I personally would probably size down in the future. I've got a medium but would probably get a small depending how you like it to fit. I like mine to be fairly tight fitting. I wasn't too sure about this item when I seen it on the website but I know it's quite a popular print at the minute. I thought it was worth picking up to see how I liked it and I liked it a lot better on than what I thought. It was this, I'm not sure what the print's called, I would call it grandad print, um, cardigan. It's like, I know it's like really on trend at the minute to wear cardigans just on their own, which I did do on one of the try on clips. I also put it with that brown turtleneck t-shirt that i just shown you. The only thing was, it's, I can't describe it, but I don't think it looked right. I personally think it would be nice just on its own. Um, and I actually really, really liked it on. It was a nice fit, nice material. It's quite thick, which is good. $25.99. I got it in a medium. But because I was unsure whether or not I'd want to wear it on its own or over something, I think I'd probably size down next time and just wear it on its own. And have a bit more of a tighter fit because it is quite slouchy especially like round the like collar here but i actually really liked it which i was shocked at to be honest not got much left guys Look, more shoulder pads but hey ho and then a khaki color i think you can probably tell the kind of colors that i'm liking at the minute this is so nice but it's like a leggy material it's also double lined if you didn't want to wear a bra, I didn't on the try on clip, you don't have to wear one. The shoulder pads are quite large, but I really, really like them. The thing I like about Zara bodysuits as well is I've got quite a long torso. And sometimes, like with bodysuits, I can't actually clip them because I'm too tall for them. So if you are tall like myself, this is 
so good for that. But in a medium again, and it was 15 99 which I think is such a bargain. And I just love it. I love the colour. I think it's perfect for autumn, winter. And yeah, I would definitely recommend. The next item is something that I buy like three to five of every year. And it's a jacket. So like a shirt jacket. When I used to work at Topshop, someone said to me, oh, we've got these jackets coming in. I was like, what the hell is a jacket? And they're like, oh, it's a shirt jacket. Like, do you not know? I was like, no. I ended up buying like five that year and I still wear them now. Like, I'm obsessed. This was the first one that I got. Now, I do like them to be oversized. So I got this in a large, but I would definitely say it's already oversized and it was way too big. You'll see on the clip, like the try on clip, I would say probably a small because they're still big and although I do like them oversized it just looked a bit like a tent on me but in terms of the actual product it was $29.99 so an absolute bargain it's like that kind of like a corduroy material but not quite it's fairly like striped I don't know if you can see little stripes it's got the black buttons like the utility pockets it's really thick it's really heavy and I absolutely love it I'm not sure if it would class as a jacket or just a shirt but I would wear it oversized layered on top of something like the brown bodysuit or the green bodysuit with jeans or even those brown leggings it's just perfect I absolutely love it I'm just good it's a bit too big and finally another jacket not I maybe wouldn't class this as a jacket, I'd class that more as one, is this. It's like a pink, pink like nude, grey, so all like your autumn winter colours. I got it in a large, it fit really nice actually. It was a bit more expensive, so $49.99. I think that might be due to the material. So it's like a a woolly material. I do really like it and I do think it's nice. The only issue I've got with it is actually the material that irritates my skin. Um, so I, I am going to be sending it back because that, cause I just wouldn't be comfortable in it. But you'll see on the try on clip if you're not like me and a bit of a, a softy with stuff like that. It is really, really nice. It's got the big pockets perfect to just throw over something so that's everything for today guys i really hope that you enjoyed watching it i certainly enjoyed filming it i love buying clothes i love trying on clothes and like i said zara just absolutely killing it at the minute everything i bought was good quality and the things that i will be sending back are more because i've picked up like the wrong size and not like the fit or anything i loved all of it um, I'll link everything that I bought down below so if you do want to buy it you can go straight to it and I'll see you guys all next week if you do have any suggestions of any other videos that you'd like to see please comment them down below and as always like and subscribe